G'day guys, how's it going? It's Blood Teeth here, bringing you another video of Gemcraft Frostborn Wrath. And this would be part two of me doing endurance on field H3. Uh, I've got to the point where I now have a grade 52 gem um, here as my main killing gem, which will take care of all the special monsters that come on the field, at least take care of them up to a certain point. I've got a grade 56 gem in the enragement slot. Um, hopefully, if somehow. Oh, pardon me. Somehow, if I can save up that much mana before I've sent all the waves, I might be able to upgrade it to grade 57. I'm not so sure. But this is already looking. Uh, it's definitely shaping up to be a better run than my previous attempt on this field. So, fingers crossed, let's see how things go. Sending all waves. Uh, let's see, yeah, everything is as it should be, except for maybe I can do that. Yeah, I can do that, that's fine. Uh, that's about it, let's send all waves and see how things go. Now the good thing about um, having these shrines that shoot their paths over all of the paths that the monsters are walking on is that it reduces lag quite a lot. So hopefully sending all waves won't take, you know, the three or four hours that it usually takes me to play this sort of endurance run with um, shrines. Hopefully it will only take no more than maybe 30, 35 minutes tops. Is this set to special? Yep. Okay. We're golden. Discharging both of these shrines should bring, uh, should bring back the monster count on the field back to below around 550 and that is very good for my computer well wow, 210 even better you just have to make sure that we tag the leaders so that we can easily see them and when they come close we'll just zap them into place Same goes for all of these. <laughs> Look at that, the shrines have already fully charged again, but I'm not going to go ahead and use them just yet. I'm going to let the monsters bank up a little bit. Uh, the reason being is because every time you discharge a shrine, its charging time becomes around 7 or 8 seconds longer. So at the moment the charging time is only 165 seconds for each of these shrines. But by the time I get to... Oh, pardon me. Wow. I really should stop yawning during my videos. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, by the time we get to, you know, wave 1,200 odd, um, yeah, that's, that's when we run into a little bit of trouble because the charge time can take around 350 to 400 seconds. It's not such a big issue on this particular field. I don't find myself scrambling for you know, shrine charge to, you know, get rid of that last monster, for example. It's really shouldn't be an issue at all. But 
Still something to be mindful of. Oh well, how do you do? A monster actually snuck through. Let's wait for him to get inside. Yep, there we go. Lovely. Let's hit those shrines. Get rid of all these monsters. And continue. Onward and upward. Yeah, I don't understand this. I've got one, two, three gems in lanterns, all applying slow. And yet somehow these monsters are still coming out on top. It's just ridiculous. They're coming out of here without actually having slow applied to them. That's not good enough. Let's apply a trap there and see if that gets all the stragglers. Whoa, where do these guys think they're going? Okay, time for me to hit the shrines again. Because this is running a little bit slower than I'd like it to be. I wish you could just turn off this charging animation. I wish you could just make it go and you know, just calculate it and then shoot out its beams. That would be much better. I mean yeah, it's a nice looking effect but well honestly it's, it's just a bit of a waste of time at this point. There we go, 476 monsters. That's a lot more manageable. Let's tag these two. Make sure we see exactly where they are at all times. Oh, hello. What's that? Ah, it's a spectre. No problems. We can deal with this spectre with no worries.
and it looks like my simple solution may have worked it looks like all of the monsters are now getting tagged with um, slow which is good I really don't understand why these aren't doing it they should fire against a lot of monsters really quickly eh, who knows maybe there's a targeting conflict no, that doesn't make sense. The game would just go through and check the targeting for each one in sequence. Wouldn't it? I don't know. Uh oh. I've got to stop freezing this spectre. Because as it stands it's actually not in the kill zone yet in fact it's just in a sweet spot oh, 13 more seconds jeez I'm going to wait for the spectre to re-enter the kill zone. And then I'll fire off the shrines. Was that a shadow I saw? No, it's an apparition. Where is that apparition? I see these little guys. Cheeky little buggers snuck right through. Hmm. Let's get rid of some monsters. Ah, there's the apparition. Right here. I'm going to get rid of some monsters by firing off this shrine only. So that I can at least make this happen a little bit quicker. Because it's taking forever for that damn spectre to unfreeze. Yeah, that didn't remove as many as I'd liked, but, well, it is what it is. That's fine. Two point four seconds. Come on. What? Okay. I killed it outright. Sure. Whatever works, I suppose. That's much better. It's 
make sure we know where everything is. Okay. Wait, did I freeze these? Oops, didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Jeez, that's fatigue for you. I'm getting tired. But I need to stay awake. We need to do this endurance, and we need to do it well. Uh, and we need to stop that guy from getting through. Hey, what the hell? Are you slow? You're not even slowed. How is this possible? How? Where are you coming from? Uh, I don't know. I can't figure it out. I reckon they're coming from over here, but this, this makes no sense. Call myself out here. Is it from here? Potentially. <sighs> Potentially not. Okay. see I see all of you here we go okay things are slowing down it's time to go ahead and hit these shrines again around about now would be good There we go, 634 monsters, that's more like it. Okay, there's a shadow on the field, which means it's time for me to give it the uh, smack treatment. <laughs> 
And same thing with this spectre. Alright. Now that we've made them bleed. We can, theoretically. Oh, you just had to move right then, didn't you? Okay. That's alright. Two can play this game. Hey, look where you are. You're in the kill zone, buddy. Bye-bye Shadow, and now bye-bye Spectre.